All right. I am refreshed, refilled, and ready to noodle on by. So give me that popcorn. I need I need the car I'm carb loading. Carb loading for a long run. So it definitely seems like I need at least two of the puff balls. I need to not die to grass. I find it very disconcerting that the grass is down here where I need to go. So I'm always worried that I'm not fast enough and that I just get killed. And now I have a squid over here just dying and blocking my path. Cool. Sucks to be that squid, but I'm a slug cat. Lizard, no! Oh, tr slug cat, slug cat, turn around. Nope. Okay. It was nice having a karma flower. How bad of luck was that? Because I, I, I feel like that lizard had to have gone in in a very specific series of directions without hesitation to get there before me. Oh, fuck. Well, I'm at zero karma anyway, so it's not like it matters too much. Other than just replaying this area over and over again. Come on, slug cat. You call that sliding? You can do better than that. Uh, let me let me take a rock just in case. Why does slug cat keep going into tunnels backwards? It's driving me crazy. It moves so damn slow when it happens. All right, we do the wall jumperoo. Good shit. There's the scaredy bug with all the eyes. Yep, yep, yep. Stop rushing me. Stop it. Bloody hell. Get out of my way. I'm trying to go this way. Sheesh. All right. We'll leave the lizard over there. Is there a fucking bird here? I thought I left you behind like three areas ago. Oh, this is awful. Alexa, this is awful. Plays Despacito. Yeah, trigger the bees. Yep. Ah, sh shoot. Oh, no, 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 no. Not good, not good. Break the bees, break the bees, break the bees, break the bees. Break the bees. Ah! Yeah. <sighs> Rain world is tough like that. Hmm. Am I missing someplace? I get the map. Take the crawler over, and then we keep dying over there. Oh, where am I now? It's right here. Is 
that was where I died last time. Get over, we died there. Yep, yep, I just need to not suck. <laughs> just gotta get good. It's just how it is. Nah. Like, cat, please. How are you going ass first into these tunnels? My friend. My noodly, sluggy little comrade. You do yourself a disservice. Why do we have combat music? I think going ass first is just the way of the slug. You know what? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I can see that. That's just that's just how slugs are, I guess. <laughs> I, I, I think you may agree. I wonder if I... Alright, I don't have a lizard this time. But, now that I think about it, what if I... Ah. There we go. We triggered the bees and nothing happens. That's right. Get fucked. Useless bees. Wait, my spores. All right, all right, all right. Hey, we made it up top this time. Let's go. Let's go. All right, we need some of those spears, actually. So, hold on. Put those there. Grab a couple spears. Dude, did you see Okay, we got the antlers. Houston, we've got the antlers. All right, take take a drink, you know. Do do take a take a full bath. Understandable. But uh, if you could if you could kind of you kind of kind of move move on, my friend, my friend, comrade, comrade, have some slug cat solidarity. I need you. I need you to move. I really need you to move, friend. Friend. All right. I guess we are fucked once again. My uh, my Uber is defective. Are you seriously going to be outside of my range? Are you seriously going to do me dirty like this? Alright. Am I doing this wrong, or is it is it just the AI is this janky? Is, is, is this the expected experience when using the Ubers, because... Steals... 
not great. I have to admit. Like I don't, I don't, I'm not seeing any other way to interact with it other than Alright, good stuff. Good to know. Ah. Oh, now you move! Yeah, that's what I expected. Um, pretty sure there's nothing I can do actually. You missed. You missed. Aha, you missed. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? You missed! Aha! Wow. Dude. For someone who's stabbed me a few times, uh, you're certainly having a hard time doing it this time. Alright, go ahead and end me. Good stuff. Seems like I am cursed. Which is not a good thing. But I will not be deterred. I will not be stopped. The slug cat is inevitable. I will find my way back to my family. Come hell or high water. Actually, it's more like just the high water. Like, the high water is the hell of this world. Although, you'd think with so much water... Like, it would really wear away the stone pretty damn fast, actually. How do I get up there? Hold on. Next zone, go up and then right. Hmm. Interesting. Share the tip. Um, let me get one more stab at it. That's just more, more puff things. Okay, decisions. Do we go upper path or lower path this time? Let's do lower And then over, and then over, and then down. I see one. All right, all right. I hope it grabs that and I don't accidentally get it killed. Ah! 
I'm afraid if I jump down onto it, it's going to uh, bend further down and then the grass gets me. Slag it. Come on, Moot! Come on, Uber! Yeehaw! Yeehaw! I I really don't want to stab you because I feel fucking. I no longer have compunctions against stabbing you. This is like the third time you've specifically killed me. Okay. All right, hit, hit me, hit me, hit me with a tip, Glottle, because uh, as as fun as suffering as this is, I would prefer to not s get stuck here the whole fucking night. <laughs> ah! I am, I am a suffer machine. It's like a fucking one Rick and Morty meme with the fucking. Butter serving robot. Why do I exist? You exist to amuse everyone else with your suffering. Frequently staying in one place or moving in the wrong direction, player can wiggle their controls back and forth in order to prompt the creature to begin moving. Wiggling causes it. Okay. I need to wiggle waggle. I need to wiggle wiggle. I see. I've been like pushing in just one direction, so that actually is something new. Alright, I caught you, but I, apparently I can't eat you unless I kill you. Whatever. For something that's so scared of me, you seem to be intent on following me. Mitt got. Oh my fucking. Go out of the go away, bug. Go away. Fuck off. Wow, did that actually kill it? Damn. Maybe these spores are more dangerous than I thought they are. Yeah. Thanks, Vol. No, I need. Imagine you need to drag a corpse out of your way because. Alright, we have our Uber tickets. I'm glad I haven't failed any of those jumps yet. Yet being the qualifier here. There's still an opportunity! <laughs> It's going to get me killed again, ain't it? Oh, I only have... I'm already... I've already wasted half my time. Cool. Beans. Oh, 
All right, it's kind of kind of wiggly. Come on, 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 come on. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Come on, come on, my friend. Avasti, mateys. Well, I was trying to stab it, but I missed. Come on! I think it's just... I think it's... I think dropping... I think dropping the spores in the grass really confuses the heck, heck out of it. Let me... Let me try zoning and see if that gives the AI a little nudge. Come on, my friend, buddy, old pal. Yeah, yeah, I saw that coming. Okay, bottom path not doing so hot. So let's go back to trying the top path because I am really annoyed at that. I am peeved, one may say. Stretch. All right. Oh, let's stretch those forearms. Ah. Ah. And you too should take a minute to stretch and hydrate. Ah. If you've been sitting a good long while. Dude, go away, squid. All right, I fucked up. Now there's two corpses in my way. All right, let's get that out of my way. Grab this corpse. Can I throw it behind me? Nope. Throwing it straight forward. Good to know. Okay, if I turn around, I can throw it. I right, turn around. Grab. Grab. Turn around. Throw it. Turn around. Ugh, tedious. So very tedious. Needless. Waste of food. The biomass could have been harnessed. Instead, it is going to rot in the pipes of this dead and barren world. You know, if these are the Farm arrays. I wonder what they were growing here. So if they had like their their cities were all up on the sky towers above the clouds in low earth orbit. And the farm arrays for their foodstuffs were like on the actual ground and imported. Did they eat this? this aggressive grass or did this grass sort of mutate because of you know them not being around and then all this other stuff ah fuck off bees you eat string cheese these are string bees Neither of you are the same. 
Ah, uh, fuck me. Did I? Hold on. Can I get my? All right. I got my Uber. I got my Ubers. Let us go. Let us go, my friends. Let us go. Okay, I'm actually gonna put the spores in here first. Um. Because I want to get that in the wall. In the wall. Good stuff, good stuff. So here's the plan. Now we get the spores. And I can get up to the next level. All right, good shit. All right, all right. Now go left. Go left, go left, left. Yes, yes. All right, we're finally making progress again. And we have an extra um, Uber ticket. Dude, please, please do not kill me. I don't know what y'all have against slug cats. I bring you delicious, delicious spores. Do I have to get off? Yes, I do. Um, I don't have a spear. Please don't make me use my Uber ticket just to get up there. You. All right. I find myself frustrated at this bit of game design. Not gonna lie. Man. I cannot catch a break. We can backtrack, we can get a couple more Uber tickets. Good. I have like no fucking time to. Bunker, yeah, yeah, bunker would be nice. Yeah, yeah, for sure. For realsies. It's so sad because I've been having a really great time, but we are running into a lot of kitsch that is driving me up the wall. You know what? You know what? Yeah, yeah, I think I think the squids squids will work on this. We'll just we'll just squid our way over. Are you f fucking with me? Hey Kasara, welcome on by. I hope you're having a great Friday. Sacrificing my squid! Nope, I'm dead. I have like no time. It's it's about to rain anyway. We'll just we'll just we'll just, we'll, we'll we'll call this we'll call this a wash.
like I definitely do not mind scuff because I fuck up. Because I fuck up enough. <laughs> but uh, this, where 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 it's outside my control, where the AI just happens to fall on a way that is not conducive to me surviving. It's been frustrating today. But we got through the, um, the floaty squids at five pebbles. We will get through some stupid fucking ubers feeding us to the grass. And then when we're when when we've extracted everything we needed from the Ubers, we legislate them away. Replace the Ubers with trains. That does make me wonder. So the ancients, or the previous entities, they built all these towers and cities um, above the clouds. How did how did people travel between them? Were <clears throat> were there like interconnected gates? Did the entities? Because like that one thing we saw, if, if that was exactly the previous one of the entities it seemed like it flew but if it was that big then i'm not sure why the cities look the way they do if that makes sense because the cities sort of reminded me of like pueblo mud houses as i mentioned so that it, it, they seem much more like a normal person sized sort of thing If they were those giant floating entity entities, then I don't know why they um, they would have such buildings. Or it could be that having ascended to a higher existence, one's form changes. That would certainly be interesting. If so, you have your evolutionary cycle, how things are advancing and becoming more sentient sapient and 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 sentient if so like something on this world goes from like slug cat then they go up to scavenger into another when they're reincarnated and then they go up to whatever the previous entities were keep going keep going my friend um you know at, at, at each level your your form changes as you are more enlightened. Huh? Huh? Yeah, yeah, that's right. It's delicious, isn't it? Keep on going. I know you need me to pay you twice. But keep on going. No. 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 Bad Uber. Bad Uber. One star. One star. One star! Yeah, you you think I'm paying you by the mile? Nah, this is flat rate, my friend. You're you're just you're just putting more wear and tear on your spindly little spindly little uh, tires there. <laughs> yeah, with inflation these days, you gotta pay them two two puff balls for the same t same distance they used to take you for one puff ball. What are you doing? So dainty. Alright, I guess I'll just die then. Cool. I don't know why it just won't go past that. I don't know if I'm just having bad AI or if I'm messing something up, but... 
it, it it seems like I I I I need to make the other path work because that path is just not <laughs> just not. <laughs> I would certainly say Rain World, thus far, my experience, the core elements are very, very strong, very good, well integrated. But as we start, as we get to these things where it's branching out and adding these other elements, it's not as tightly cohesive of a game. Um, and like the game that, the one that I, I, I comes to mind as a comparison is, is like Hollow Knight. So Hollow Knight is another, um, game I think that does environmental storytelling very well, but I think it does a much better job of having the game show you things and way you, ways you can play. Um, the, the biggest one that comes to mind is like how I found the B area. Like I, I was suffering, unable to find it. And I messed up my rock throw there, but fair enough. I also didn't have a spear. Um, but like in, in Hollow Knight, the game has a really good curve as far as showing you your new your moves, showing you ways to progress, how things work together. In this one, you know, we first ran into the um, we ran into the grapple hook grub, which in in an abstract and and I'll. I'll give a couple other stabs while I'm on this rant, but if I if I haven't made any progress, I'll I'll, I'll probably ask for ask for a little bit of help just for the sake of making progress. <laughs> I don't want to be stuck here for three hours. <laughs> as embarrassing as that is, it's one thing to struggle bus on my own; it's another struggle bus while everyone's watching me. <laughs> I swear I'm good at video games. I swear. But um, the the grapple grub in the abstract. It's interesting, all right. You add you add a way to to hook shot across areas, but you're sacrificing a a hand slot. You know, it's 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 a risk. It's a it's a sacrifice. It's a balanced reward. It gives you more ways of navigating the world. I love it. I do think it is a good thing. Problem because they're going so hard onto the environmental learning. Um, they don't tell you how to use the grub. They just have these grubs suddenly show up. And I'm pretty sure I spent an hour and a half, like, first I was grabbing them and then like I couldn't eat them. And then I was having trouble dropping them and I just started like going whatever the fuck. I just have a grub in my hand now, I guess. And after about an hour and a half, of I think I died twice or so in in that area because it bugged out and I just take I just got lasered inside the tower for about 10 minutes without it going to game over and I, I I finally I finally asked someone it's like hey am I missing anything with these grubs and they're like oh you have to double tap jump for them to do anything it's like, oh I mean okay but like nothing I never would have guessed I would need to use double jump, double tapping jump to, to use the grub. Like there's there's so many buttons on a controller that are unused. Um, duplicating a button, like it, it's just out of left field and was really frustrating. Um, and also now with this, like I have to use, as far as I can tell, I have to use these deer to 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 cross these red slugs. I, 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 the spores don't seem to bother them. The the firecrackers don't seem to bother them. Um. So 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 yeah. Uh. So uh. Faye 
Fahrenheit. And, and definitely let me know if I'm if I'm mispronouncing your handle. Um, I know I know I have weird pronunciations sometimes because I've I've learned more words than I understand because uh, I used I used to and still read too much. Um, but if you have any general pointers that could perhaps improve my odds of getting the fucking deer to function, I am all. My serpentine ear bones are open. Whee! Nope. Yeah, and I... Because, because I like going into things completely blind and completely vanilla as is, no mods, no, no nothing, it's gonna be really frust. It's gonna be darkly f amusing if uh, if I check for like the mods or I think I've seen the remix on the main screen. Main screen. I don't know if remix is like modifiers to the game or if it's like that's the mod menu. But if there's a thing that's basically like f fix broken reindeer AI kind of thing, I am going to cry. And wish and and wonder why it's not in the base camp. <laughs> All right. Yeah. If you have if you have any. Oh, I'm. Oh, am I fucked, my friends? Oh. Nice. Okay. Yeah. No, that's that's fine. Yeah, if you have if you have any any pointers as far as maybe the better path, because as far as I can tell, I have two I have two options: an upper path and this lower path. I don't know if there if there's a more a better way to get the deer to bless me with their antlers. Are, oh, so this so this one this one is useless. Got it. Wow. And that seemed to be the easier one. I need that spear so I can go backwards. That's probably why they have that spear there. I will say one nice thing, for as random as it is, whenever there's areas that you need spears. They tend to provide you spears. I do like that. They at least factored that much into the game. few other paths. Really? What am I missing? Hold on. So got up, left. Get to there, left. I don't know, that's the wrong one. So I'm here. That can't connect. No, those two connects. That goes right, left. Hmm, I'm not seeing another path. Unless it's a you have to go backwards to go forwards kind of path. Yeah, it's so frustrating because like I, I understand uh, AI is difficult, emergent gameplay is a thing, 
You, you need that wiggle room. So it's, it's sort of the thing where it's like I can see the problem, but I can't, I cannot uh, offer a solution. Oh look, a karma flower spawned. Cool. All right, all right, people. We gotta, we got, we we have some protection for our karma now. Oh yeah. Even though we're at zero. Could you not drown me? That would be really fucking cool. Okay, we'll put that there. We're gonna get a second goddamn spear this time. Ray! Ray! I hope your Friday evening is going well, my friend. favorite noodle. Shh. Psh. I bet you say that to all the serpents. <laughs> Alright. So now we drop one here. We grab our spear. It's gonna come launch that. I can jump from the second story onto its antlers. Also, I don't know how, like, I know I accidentally figured out that the spores work for the reindeer. But I feel like a better way, like, I, I found it by accident, which is convenient. Um, I think a better way would have been if there was, like, a, a tree with the spores and you could see them eating the spores, and then we had spores we could grab that were underground. I think that would have been a much better way to environmentally show, like, hey, the deer will come down and grab the spores. Um, because I can, I can only imagine how stuck and frustrated I would be if I didn't even know the spores would, would bring them. Or I could just fucking die, like this. Hi, my name is Drecky. I get- I touch grass, and it kills me. Shloop. Also, um, um, Ray, I don't know if you saw in your server, uh, uh, Chibi, Chibi, uh, I fucking bawled my eyes out. Um. Oh, yeah, I'll step. Yep, yep, yep. And yep. then I have to go put the yep, water yep, yep. somewhere else five minutes later. Had to happen eventually. All, all hours tonight. of the night. No matter what I'm doing, my life is interrupted by this. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Stretch and a hydrate. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, let me, as, as a palate cleanser, as a palate cleanser, let's let's look at let's look at the amazing thing Chibi Doki says was a uh, work in progress. Uh, let's see, like holy shit, holy shit, oh my dog. Hello? Hello? The fucking they have my my little tailpiece is like a belt. My my fucking head like oh, I, I I it was very much a hey, want to see how hard I can cry moment? Like oh, I love it. I love it so much. Oh my god. E even if the even if they decide this is all they want to do with it and they're done working on it, like I, I want to fucking plaster this everywhere. Um, God. 
I, I honestly, actually, I think this is my first, like, um, Drecky fan art now that I think about it. Mo most of my art's kind of been, kind of been commissioned. So they, they get, they get a special medal for being, being the first Drecky, first Drecky farter. <laughs> It's, uh, I don't know. It's, it's fucking crazy. It's, it's wild. I, I first had thoughts of doing some streaming about five years ago. And the biggest block back then is I don't, I'm not, I don't, I don't really want to have a camera on me but I didn't like there's a lot of I'm a very like y'all can only see like for my face and me moving around but I'm a very like animated speaker I gesture a lot I move around a lot and I, f I felt like if I streamed and didn't have a representation of me it wouldn't really be so great because a lot of my inspiration were people who did like let's plays um and stuff like that and so there, uh, it's a lot of it was just like hey i want to show people some of these old games that i like that nowadays maybe not be as well known <laughs> me knocking everything off my desk because i talk with my hands <laughs> see that's why i have a pretty clean desk pretty pretty clear on this prevents that issue. Although I keep, I'll bump my camera or er, camera, uh, microphone now that, off. Oh, fuck me. Um, I fell down, I, I became aware of VTubers, um, at the start of world events and fell down that rabbit hole. So I was like, wow, this is a way I could have I could have that kind of, like, visual representation of me but it's not like you know a webcam of me because there's also like if you have a webcam on yourself you might need to like actually wear a shirt and do your hair up or like generally look nice for other people <laughs> sometimes that uh that executive dysfunction is just like yeah you got you got energy for two things out of the five things you want to do today. Pick, pick, pick your poison, and then everything else won't get done. <laughs> I gotta say, being able to, being able to not have to worry about one of them makes it a lot easier. Not gonna lie. I'm gonna die. Look for example, I'm gonna them. Relatable, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so I ended up. It, it took a while. I ended up with, with. Ah, this! Holy shit! That's a that's a strong green. Usually, if I throw a spear in their face, they they'll like flinch. But that one took it like a champ. Fuck it. Actually, you know what? Hold on. You know what? I I know I put them in here, but I didn't know if I'd use it. We'll, we'll grab that guy and put him. You know what? Let's put him in the background. Ah! Hold on. Let me let me lock myself. I'll take this guy. We'll have him menace. We'll have him sit menacingly in the background. <laughs> You should have used the gnomes earlier as a distraction. But uh <laughs> ah! I could have sworn I had a higher cooldown on gnomes. I'm gonna have to gnome that. Alright. All right. <laughs> Yes, with all the power of the gnomes, we will 
defeat these foul grass beings. Strem should hydrate. All right, all right. My my hammies are feeling a little little neglected, so let's kind of oh, lean forward a little bit. All right, kind of like kind of like slug cat. Kind of lean forward. Ah, oh. and then we have some hydration. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Good shit. Some good shit. And then I fucked it all up. Whatever. I was going over here anyway. But. <clears throat> I don't know. Streamers helped me in a rough time. And ever since then. Especially since I have ended up getting all this. I, I had goals to try and. Have a kind of positive positive energy to maybe help others who went through a similar time that I did and it's humbling to 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 think I've impacted people for the positive like that Just, you put a piece of your soul out there whenever you create something whether it's art a video um, writing some of you is in that, and I think that's what makes us human, and I think that's the great part of being um, a part of humanity, is contributing and helping your fellow peoples. Um, sometimes you do things, or say things, or make things, and you don't even know someone sees it or was touched by it, but they were. And you make that difference. Um, whether you know it or not. So it's always worth putting in the effort when you're able to. Because the energy you put out is energy you get, I like to think. I need you to not be in my way. Could you comply? Can you comply? Bye. Bye. <laughs> Never quiet. <complain. laughs> I see, Ray. I see. Spoken like someone who's definitely not at the um. <clears throat> what's the what's the what's the right phrase? Some kind of lower area sort of existence, some kind of... <laughs> some sort of bottom area. <laughs> oh, is that my only spears? Fuck me, I guess. <laughs> ah, shit! I was gonna say, like, I'm the streamer, you can't- you can't control me, but then I realized I gave people gnomes, and now I regret all my decisions. <laughs> Alright. I healed, I healed, I'm sorry, Ray, I'm sorry! Hey, Rudran, welcome on by. Ah, but see, there is still one thing I can do. What's his idea to lock himself in a cage? <laughs> I need you to turn around. Por favor. Or you could try and climb up the wall, you know. You you do you, fucking... Fucking thingamajig. I don't... Is it... I swear these things are trying to kill me. I do have this though, because uh, if y'all don't know, Ray is an amazing dino dog that doesn't deserve to be doing time in jail because uh, they vored themselves. So you should give them a gander. They do some pretty cool art. Um, they did my PNG version. No, 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 no. Keep going, keep going, keep going! 
Wait, I see a spear. Uh, hold on. I don't know which one's in my throw hand, so let me just put that down. Put a spear in there. Not like you're also pretty great or anything, Baga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, see, I'm the streamer, so that means I get to control who's shouted out, and you have to deal with it. By weird deer flea thing. Oh, oh, Rudran. Oh, Rudran. If only. God damn it! Fuck! <laughs> to fix that apparently <laughs> I didn't even realize oh fuck oh shit shit hold on oh fuck 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 all right all right all right I broke okay <laughs> it's turned off <laughs> I didn't, re I didn't realize I had it set so anyone could do it. Fuck. <laughs> oh, oh shit, I just realized. Oh, no, 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 no. Mm. Actually, mm, hold on, hold on. Oh, thank god I don't have all the other commands. I don't have the command that lists all commands. Um... St streamer, hold on, streamer bot? Streamer bot. Where do I change things? Uh, um. No, I have to go into the command itself, don't I? Okay, um. Okay, okay, that one's locked down. Okay, so that. No? Wait, hold on, that one's the same. Oh, I need to switch it to... Maybe I just need to flip it around, actually. Okay, actually, hold on, actually, hold on. Someone, someone do, someone do the shout out real quick. Just, just to test to see if I, if... I just needed to flip the permissions around. Right. Okay. I just had to switch the permissions around. I'm dumb. Noted. Let me fix it for the other one that would be obnoxious if y'all knew about it and did the same thing with. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Alright. Alright. We're good now. No, 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 no. No, 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 no! I thought I could make it! No, it's not a secret command. I'm pretty sure some of y'all have seen it. For example, um... If y'all... I know they've been hanging out and vibing. I don't know how they're aware that I exist. Um, but... Speaking of amazing artists, um, Favor Knight, uh, <laughs> hey, <laughs> it's a reindeer. <laughs> what is happening? Oh, my God! Oh, my God. <laughs> I am, I am, I'm grateful, I think. But thanks. I'm about to freeze to death, so we're going inside. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, yeah, that, that would have been, that would have been the command, uh, uh, uh. That also might have gotten insane if y'all had spammed it. For the last 10 years, god damn. 
Well, I'm not surprised, uh, cause Ray has- you have refined taste. And are a gem amongst us mere mortals. Ooh. Ooh, I see I see a cow ethic emote. You know what? I think that might have been the person that raided into you. <clears throat> Cause I, I've been hanging out at cacao's um whenever I get a chance. Because cacao, cacao's a gem. His little comms open soon taunts me. I would love, I would love to, to commission him. It's like, I, I certainly... <clears throat> I certainly like uh, uh, Drecky how he be at the moment, but my my philosophy as far as as far as VTube thing, I like having, I like I like having multiple forms, and because my thoughts is, you know, my character having spatial magics is is basically. Uh, breaching into other dimensions, which causes interesting effects upon my physiological form. And Cacao's creature design, uh, I don't know. I'm certainly going to ask, I, would, I wouldn't mind just a straight up Drekki in some form, but also if he's amenable to maybe uh, some kind of alternate sort of Drekki inspired existence I think that I think they would have some pretty sweet ideas there's another person who I want a a Drekki form but I don't know when their commissions are gonna be open probably won't be for a long while she's probably pretty busy one of those issues where the artist is their own VTube, uh, VTuber uh, creator. So the the fun side of, hey, you get to make your own model. And the downside of, oh, you're making your own model. Drekki Gajinka? It might be because it's late, but Gajinka is not ringing a bell. Are you fucking serious, Grass? Are you fucking? You fucking with me? Mate? You fucking with me? You gotta be fucking with me, mate. Oh, I can't believe you rock fucking with me. I'm fucking here, fucking slug catting my way up, and you fucking grab me like that, bring me into the ground, you bringing me down, mate. It's not very, it's not very solidarity with you, grass, mate. We're all here in the same struggle. Here trying to rise up across the proletariat. We gotta rise up against these, against these towers rising up against us. All this rain keeping us down. We gotta work together, mate. Do I keep it as a legume? <laughs> uh, we almost had that. Uh, uh, Cause I know we did a ad hoc bean, but um, I have I have a love of sundews, and as she was about to draw it, I was like, "Could I have? Could I have like a sundew bean?" And she made that instead. Uh, I mean, I am, I am certainly spitballing what a more humanoid version would look like. Like, again, my biggest problem is I, I don't know something unless I see it. So, the only thing I have is maybe, like, Cobalt-ish, but it's like, that's still a huge range um, I don't know. Also, um, ads are about to strike in case you need to adjust volume. If you stick around, I'll see ya when I see ya. Pinterest time? Yeah. 
Yeah, and there's, oh, there's so many fucking cobalts. That's so hard. For a second, honestly, <laughs> uh, I thought I thought you were saying like uh, I read Jinka as um, as Yaru. <laughs> I was so confused. <laughs> Because <laughs> I know when I finally put the PNG in as like a, a redeem switch. I'm thinking it's to be like Dimension Shift uh, Flatland or something like that. Dimension Shift Spinways. Um, I do think like a... The ones off the top of my head that I think might inter be interesting would be like... Um, Eldritch and perhaps like Fey Chalk Zone. <laughs> Well, I mean, Flatland is actually like a a short story. Wait, is that a H hello scavenger? I don't know what you're doing over here, but it's probably a bad idea. Oh, like an act. Oh, like a chalk zone, Drecky. <laughs> I mean, I am, I have been thinking about doing a, uh, making a, like, take on me, redeem, but I would need to find a filter that can kind of make me sketchy and black and white in a way that works with the, the take on me music video. <laughs> I think that would be pretty funny. birds. Oh, I'll fucking... You want some? You want some, you fucking bird? Come and get it. Come and get it! I'll be gone Alright. Now would have been a good time for like the the deer to have like it back its back opens up and some anti-air missiles just like fire out to destroy the bird. I would have really appreciated that. Would have been really out of nowhere, but like please <laughs> just fucking <laughs> take it all down. <laughs> all right. Can this piece of shit take me all the way across so I can maybe make some progress? Noodle kid. Just got here, what are we doing? Hey, welcome on by. We are attempting to finish Rain World today. If our Uber will oblige us. Um... Unfortunately, our Uber is not cooperating and has actually actively got us killed a good number of times. So, getting a one-star review, that's for sure. Uh, that's a given. Um, I will say this is my first time playing Rain World, so I would appreciate uh, uh, no no spoilers. Just uh, laugh at my suffering, and I'll certainly let you know if I'm feel if I feel a little too stuck and could use a bit of assistance. 
Oh, oh, he's just going. Are you? Can I? Can I keep going? Actually, hold on. Can I? Nope. No zone transition. All right. All right. I think this is the first time we've had a spore going into this next area. I'm excited. Maybe we'll get some progress. Maybe. Wouldn't that be nice? Be so cool. Be pretty fucking sick, nasty, you know? We just got some. We just got some fucking progress here. That'd be pretty fucking cool. I see them wiggling to the left a little bit. So there's got to be something over there. Or maybe not. Maybe I'll just fucking burn it. Or I could just die. Yeah, that's cool too. Yeah, I, I love it when when I just die like this. Oh, I can just run past that anyway. Noted. I need you to go left. I need you to go left so I can get to a bunker. I need you to go left. Please, for the love of Slugcat. Oh, 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 they're stancing up. They're stancing up. What are they going to do? What are they going to do? Oh, 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 they're wiggling. Oh, they're wiggling. Oh, all right. They're passing the night. It's funny because they're like pitch black with the dangly bits. They kind of, they kind of look like ink creatures. And they're just kind of like drooping a little bit. Like the ink runs down. All right. This is my stop. There better be a bunker here. Maybe I'll get back into uh, positive karma, huh? Ooh, we got some unlocks. Hell yeah! All right, let's. Take a spear, we have a bubble, well, what's going on? Yeah, no problem, new kid. Thanks for stopping on by. I hope you have a fantastic eat. And a great rest of your weekend. All right, comrades. We are no longer at rock bottom. We have managed to climb up to Bare soil substrate. It has been a long and hard fought fight for the slug cat's advancement. But I believe together we can achieve great things. So join me. Ah, oh, thank you. All credit to the amazing artists that make it possible. Uh, Shadow Fox is that person. Oh, damn. Damn, that bug, that bug, that bug gave some food. I gave like two pips of food. Hell yeah. I guess maybe I should have been eating more insects. Um, hold on, how the fuck do I get over there? Is there... Oh, I just keep going left. Oh, I'm dumb. Snarf! Little snake man. I mean, I can be big. I can polymorph. 
It's a, it's a natural ability of any dragon. So even if I'm small, I can also be big. Is that? Ooh. Um, that looks dangerous. How about we don't run into it? I think that's a good plan. Everyone on, everyone on the same page? I don't know where I'm going. Run into it for science. Um, I think the science is just I die. I I, I, I think that's I think that's what the results are gonna be. Um, oh no, that was two of them. Music is a bop though, but was it ever in any doubt? Like, I mean, come on, this game. This game has got the ambiance. Okay. These are some weird fucking plants, mate. Oh my god, there's so many lizards. Is that the only way to go? That is my only exit. Going up or... Okay. Shit. Are you going up or down? Oh, it's going down! Slug Cat, no! Slug Cat, no! I don't know what's going on! Oh, okay. They got me. That's a lot of science. Like li licking lightning or yeeting into Jupiter. Well, we were briefly above bot rock bottom karma. Alright. Um, maybe we don't take two spears. I mean, maybe we don't take two spores. I feel like I might need a weapon. But if there's spores, I'm probably going to do more... Um, deer, deer, deer stuff. So I need at least one. She blinded me with science. Man, four lizards though. That is a lot for a room. I mean, at least none of them are camo lizards. Hey, I think I've avoided dying to a camo lizard this whole stream. Hell yeah. Unlocked a forgotten memory? Oh, oh no. Core memory unlocked? Is it a cursed core memory or a, bl or a blessed core, core memory? You blinding me with science? Yeah. I need you to ignore me. I am merely a slug cat. I am not very nutritious. I swear. Why are you screaming at me, bug? I'm not even eating you. Oh, the lyrics came flooding back. <laughs> uh, we got right or left. Oh, there's spores over here. I didn't even need to grab a spore. Man. All right, let's check to the right first. Yep, that's to the right. Okay. Uh, and better news, let's go to the left. And let's grab a second spore. Slug cat, your ass first. It's just asking to be eaten. Deer! Wait, no, I need... Wait, can I go... How do I... How do I get up? What? How the fuck do I get up? Ah, here we go.
Come on, dear. Thomas Dolby. Thought the company was named after him for a while. Yeah. Yes, partake of my offering. No fucking shot. You get a. All right, I have one more or two more. It's fucking deer, man. Fucking deer or a scam. Scam deer. You know, I'm not surprised. I have lost three side mirrors um, to deer. Those little shits. Come on, come on, come on, come and get it, come and get it. It's down, down there in the gutter. You're gonna have to, you're gonna have to, you're gonna have to bend low for me to get that one, friend. Come on, come on, come and get it, come and get it. It's right there, it's right there. Just come and, come and get it there. Come on. One of you, one of you come get this delicious, delicious spore puff, all right? It's right there, right there, just for you, just for you, my friend. Just a little bit closer and ha <laughs> gotcha. Now I need you to go turn around and you go left. Yeah, all right. Okay, let's see if this one kills me. And if it does, we'll add another marker to times the deer have killed the slug cat. Uh, don't like this. This is not looking good. This is not looking good. All right. Never mind. We're looking better. Huh, interesting. Very interesting. Ooh, new music. What is that graffiti? It looks like a like a devil with a waste um exhaust thing in its mouth spewing out. Hmm. Um, go away. I want a spear. It's very... Not somber, but... Kind of... Sad music. It's just how it feels to me. <sighs> Alright, so I guess we need to do a couple of rounds of karma farming. But I, I saw a fuck ton of food, so we should be good. Trench. All right. I drink the water. Oh shit. And then I have to go put the water somewhere else. Five minutes later. All hours of the day. All, all hours, hours of the night. night. No matter what, what I'm, I'm doing, doing, my life my is life interrupted is by, by piss. Oh, uh, thank you, Glotto, for the hydrate. Fucking love that. <laughs> the video is even more amazing. Ah, they give me two pips. Very nice. I just grab another one. Left your water ball in the kitchen? Well, yeah, you better go get it. You better chug it. Yeah, you got the you got the double piss. It's like a double rainbow, but you know, a little bit more golden, a little bit more yellow <laughs> than the other colors. <laughs> Damn, Glop. Damn, Ray. You, uh, you should have thought of that before you forgot it. 
Well, I'm starting to sound like a you problem, brother. Oh, am, I, am I sideways? No. I just thought I was sideways. Okay, we need one more round of karma. The golden arches are weird. <laughs> nice. Very nice. I don't have any spears. Helper bot, you're useless to me. There's a spear. Now I can get some popcorn. Ow! Damn! Is that me? Can I bite it? Ow! I just wanted to store the food for later. Jeez. It's like you're angry I'm gonna kill you or something. Okay. Well, at least that wasn't too bad as far as being karma gated. I, it kind of feels weird to put anything but a rank one karma gate after dealing with all those fucking uh deer but i don't know i'm not a game dev what do i know Onward we go! I probably should have eaten the full pips, actually, before I went through. I hope I don't regret that mistake. This is jamming music. Oh shit. No! Hold on, did I fuck up? Oh, I fucked up. Oh, please don't be instant death. Well, it seems like there's something down here. Oh, there's something over there too. Fuck! I am choosing all the wrong things. Apparently. Maybe. certainly going down, so I think we've gone uh, as far west as we need to go. Not what I meant to do, but fine. Maybe I just go? No? Hold on. Alright. Hey, trains! We finally found some public transport! Uh, there's a bunker, so let's save past the bullshit. Um... Eh, yeah. Oh, fuck! I need food. Right. Because I swear, I'm going to keep going, and then I'm going to get to an area, and it's going to be like, Oh, you need jellyfish karma to progress through this area! Get over here, bug. I want to eat you. I'm holding the eat button. Eat it. Thank you. That's some very eerie music, too. Ah. 
Oh, we have a new dream. Huh. That's weird. The slug cat looked kind of like a ghost, because it had like a... Well, maybe not. No, it was floating. I don't know, it's hard to tell, because the slug cat tail is kind of like... You know, a noodly tail. Oh! Oh, now there's lizards here. Oh, fuck me. Oh, I fucked up. Oh, I fucked up, didn't I? I have fucked up. Um, where do I need to go? Left or right, left or right. Um, let's go west! Let me go west and up, I think. Cut! <laughs> Fucking get get tased, bro. All right, all right, all right. Where does this go? Ooh, a karma flower. Yes. Amazing! Now we have some protection. Oh, uh, okay. Okay, all right. Leaves over here anyway. Noted, noted. <laughs> it's still trying to eat that bug. <laughs> and still getting tased. <laughs> Fucking, come on lizards. Y'all are being silly. Absolutely Philly. Okay, apparently we need to go right instead. Hmm. Now we didn't see any trains on the upper area. Which makes me wonder if the previous entities, like, flew through sub-Earth orbit between, like, they didn't, or, or if they had airplanes. I don't know. They were, the one thing we saw, if it was one of the previous entities, and its form was exactly that, seemed like it could kind of fly, despite being so big. So, maybe they could just, by their own locomotion, travel to... HOLY FUCK! OH JESUS! What the fuck? Fuck me. Well, it wouldn't be a rain world if I didn't get my fucking wits scared out of me. Alright. Uh, I didn't even see where that came from. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Well, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Or I'm bugged? Hold on. This is within 30 seconds. I think I think I won't get penalized. No, I did get penalized. I'm below jellyfish. So, my karma is also probably gone. Yep. Well, shit. Okay, but to be fair though, it's kind of bullshit to have a lizard spawn right next to your camp. That is the most jabaty fucking um, shelter I have seen yet. Oh, look! Three lizards.
No, oh, man. Yeah, 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 try to tase me. Try to tase me, bro. Try to tase me. No, 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 get over here. Get over here. Get over here. No, 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 get over here. I got something to say to you. I got something to say to you, and that, the thing I want to say is munch. Delicious. Full of protein. You'll love to see it. Uh, hey, green lizard. Um, uh, nice to see you. But not really. Okay. Um, so going above is maybe dangerous. Can we go down? God, if that thing is like in the background and comes to the foreground, that would be even, that would be awful. Is this the thing I climb? Nope. Hmm. Hold on, is there something over there? I hear something. Oh, I see! It's the return of the the, the little fucking uh, blind little thingamajigs. Uh, forget what they are. Uh, can I go left? I can go left. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, so I got a thing on the tunnel to the right. Oh, that didn't kill it. Oh. Uh, hey, wanna stand still so I can throw more spears at you? Oh, damn, they're having a rustling fight over there. Let me go up! Okay, maybe... There we go. Oh, is this... Is this useless? Is this the wrong way? What is that sound? I got tased to death? God damn. Huh, that's some kind of ominous fucking chanting. All right, all right. Get a, get a little bit of a little bit of tribal, a little bit of tribal trance. All right, I'm down. I'm down. Hell yeah, that's a fucking beat. Cyberlinks. Slug them cats to the beat. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate you stopping on by. Certainly feel like as far as what Pebbles told us to go west and then down. Uh, I feel like we've gone we've gone west as far as we've gone west. So now we're on the down half. Oh, there's an unlockable to the left. I really want to get it because I'm a terrible, terrible completionist.
All right. How about I don't go left? Oh, I don't like this at all. Come on, come on. Ooh, that's dangerous. Uh, I don't have any spears. Shit, we gotta take the upper path. Well, hopefully I don't die all of a sudden. I'm gonna eat ya. I ate ya. Is there a way to go down? Can I not go down here? Can I go down? Please let me go down. Fuck me, is that really the only way? Hold on, let me... That's not a spear. Well, sh shit. Man, this is a really awful area. There's only one way for me to go. We lost the we caught we lost the cool beats. There's not a single spear spawn. Damn, that's rough. F the chaotic honestly, I just call this place a lizard station. You know, that's 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 pretty accurate. Also, welcome on by. Oh, this isn't... Oh, I can't squeeze by there. Oh, I just... I just... Oh, I'm fucked. If he goes down, I'm fucked. He went down. Oh, is he? Is he going down or is he going up? Alright, he's staying up. A spear! I had a spear. I lost it. <laughs> she knows the cat here's <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah I'm a slug cat, so so I gotta be so I gotta be a uh, a uh, a cat snake. That makes sense. Alright. Fuck me. Well, it's not like I was using that karma for anything anyway. The slug cat enters the cycle of reincarnation. It simply dies again. It is the way of the slug cat. To live. To die. And to live again. Truly it is the worst of fates to be a slug cat. But sometimes it's worse to be a lizard who gets killed by the slug cat. Get wrecked, bitch. Your sacrifice will be forgotten. All right. I need you to fuck off, please, because that's my exit. Thank you. No f shot. L Damn. I'm the one that's supposed to debate them with the tunnels. Not you! 
My problem is my spear uh, bounced too far away for me to go re-grab. Because Slug Cat likes to move ass first through these tunnels. And is also absolute shite at turning around. Just the absolute bloody west. Alright, we got some food. Come on, come on, we gotta make it, we gotta make it. Please, 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 please. I wanna make some progress. Good shit, good shit, good shit. We're doing good, doing good. Just keep on schmoovin', keep on schmoovin'. Schmoovin', keep on schmoovin'. All right, so we go down here. That's right. Go away. Hiya. Uh, hmm. Okay. Interesting. I just want to say, fuck that room. That is a shit room. I saw grabby grass. I saw wall kelp. Ah, fuck me. Okay, we got the lizard out of there. No problem, Rudran. I hope you have a fantastic eat. And a great weekend. Oh, we have a giant uh, centipede there. Yeah, 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 that's cool, that's cool, that's cool, that's cool. So we can't go up and over, we can't go under because of the centipede. Ah, there we go. Centipede's out of our way. Hopefully we don't need to go up. I don't think we do, because we mostly need to go down, I believe. Going down, 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 trying not to die. We got green, green, green lizards in our way. Alright, that was a very complicated way just to get over here, but you know what? I'll take it, because I'm alive. And that's all that matters down here. I am alive. Uh, do I have enough food to rest? No, I don't. But I could if I got some of these blueberries. Om yum yum. Om yum yum. Okay, so let's see about getting to that safe house. Go up and over. Good shit. Uh, what the fuck is that? Oh, I don't like that. I don't, I don't know what that is, and I do not like it. I need everything gone from this screen. Oh, fuck. I hate all of this. It is terrible. Very awful. Do not like. Okay, okay, I think we looped him. I think we looped him. 
Get the fuck out of here. Blood and ashes. Hey, free food. Uh, you do you. Um, I don't know what that was, but it's fucking dead now. Thanks for eating the kelp for me, mate. Interesting. Seems to have some kind of buildings and structures. Makes me think of how in Europe there's a lot of, uh, I don't know what it's called as far as the buildings. Um, oh, this is, this is a dead end. Fuck. So like a lot of places in Europe, you know, you dig down a few hundred feet or so, or tens of feet, and you start running into, um, start running into like old Roman roads and such. The idea that like the soil is moving up and overturning other areas and like since this world has been going for so long it uh it has um like entire cities have been taken underground okay i need this thing to be down here good All right, let's eat some shrooms. Give us that slow motion. See if we can get past the kill. Like this. Woo! Just like Neo. I swear to dog, if this is a dead end, Okay. Oh! It's just over here. Fuck me! Well... At least we can get this unlock, maybe? Or did I already get it? Am I dumb? No, it reacted to me. Maybe I'm just stupid. Fuck me. Alright. Hmm. Kelp is gone, we run! Kelp is gone, we run! Let me pass. Friend? Friend, let me pass. Thank you. Hmm. I don't like this centipede. Not when I have no weapon. So I have to go that way. There we go! How am I on food? I'm good on food. Come on down! Where are you going? Come on, come on, come on! I need you to get out of my way, friend! I need you to get out of my way, friend!
Where are you going? Where are you going? Not what I meant to do, but I'll have to take it. Ooh. Yeah, let's take the bottom path. I can barely see myself, so I just gotta pray that I'm fucking going the right way. Come on, man. Why you gotta be like this? Okay, all right. Making some good progress. This area is certainly very different. Ooh. Ooh. Hold on, we went from like rock and subterranean back to machine. Interesting. Filtration system. Is this an artificial planet? So fascinating. Not where I meant to go, not where I meant to go. Oh my god, please don't kill me. Please do not kill me. Please do not kill me. Let me go, let me go, let me go, let me go, please. <sighs> I live, bitch. I live, bitch. Maybe. I... I don't know what happened there. Okay. All right. <clears throat> all right, all right, all right. All right, we are in underground. Hmm. So let's think of cycles. And it seems like we have... Machines and structures underground and then normal earth and then we have our technology on top so it's like there's there's multiple repeating species evolving rising up and then question marks god i forgot how far back i am Fucking stabbed, bro. Ha! It, it definitely keeps making me think back to, to cultivation novels and Eastern fantasy. So, like, the one I mostly keep thinking of is Cradle. So, I, I, I'm not going to give huge spoilers on it. <clears throat> Maybe some broad setting spoilers if you care about reading random. Eastern fantasy sort of novel. But there's the the entities that have ascended beyond a planet that are sort of operating on a more galactical dimensional level. Um, they have some planets where there is strife and suffering and stuff with the idea that those planets more often um, give rise 
to uh, people who can join them at the at the galactic basically, you know, amass enough personal power in some manner um, that allows them to ascend beyond the planet. Because join them on the galactic level to help, uh, and their their mandate broadly is basically to to ensure reality continues to exist against things going fucky wucky basically to to keep things succinct why can't i grab the spear you know what doesn't matter um but the these by leave by basically leaving them full of strife you know there there's a lot of suffering that's involved that uh, one could argue is unnecessary, but it's sort of a, you know, people, people are rising, there's no reason to fix what ain't broke, you know? And so there's, there's these cycles of people, um, ascending to the pinnacle of the world, and then, um, ascending beyond, or sticking around, um, I guess weird, but... My point is, there's these, there's this constant churn of people moving from a a lower status of existence, not just like class-wise, like from a peasant to king, but from a personal understanding of existence sort of manner. That seems a little, little weird, little vague, and that's because, like, um, if you've never read a lot of cultivation novels, there tends to be a common through line of imposing your understanding of existence upon the world. Um, I don't, I, I'm not too read in on on Eastern philosophy and fiction to be able to like pick it apart with nuance, but. From my my understanding is it's a lot of like someone may see the ways in which um, art could manifest in the world and why it's so important and they utilize it in interesting ways to um, impose their understanding upon others and usually there's a lot of fighting and you know all that stuff. And then another person could also be following the way of the sword. Uh, a common one is like way of the sword versus way of the saber, which is a weird nuance to to do, but it is a thing. Um, and so, like these, there's an idea that there is no, in theory, there is one unifying, correct, superior to everything concept that perfectly encapsulates um, what is reality, but in practice it's more like everyone is finding the thread that resonates with them and following that as far as they can into its most pure form. Um, so you can see a lot of weird things like art or penmanship. And then there's also your more standard combat stuff. Aw, oh, fuck. Is this like a 10 karma gate? Uh... What the fuck was that? Uh, hello? Did I just get drugs? It set me to 10. That's strange. Oh, we're getting the we're getting the tribal tribal trance again. Certainly, I, I will say like the this kind of music is very good at conveying like mysticism, kind of otherworldly etherealness, perhaps. How the fuck do I get up there? There's no fucking way I get up there. 
Fuck off. Those flames are flickering very quickly. Kind of feels like I'm in a sacred space. I don't I don't know if I'm like I don't know. Kind of feel like I'm I'm sort of Desecrating it accidentally. Although it is where I was directed to go. Always have the spear. statue. Okay. So interesting. Like, there's that gold light, and the only thing that's been like that has been those weird wisp things now and then. Which we got after, I guess now that I know, it was a brain. So I wonder if that yellow stuff is like... Something of the world that you can only perceive when you're at a certain state of enlightenment, maybe? Because it did set my karma to 10, which was interesting. Also, what? Um. Oh, and the music cuts out. Oh, that's not ominous at all. Fuck, does this game have a boss fight? Uh. Fuck. Um. Maybe I can sneak by it. Is there, like, an underground path? Nope. Strength, hydrate, fine, I'll hydrate. The question is, do we run or do we sneak? It seems too active. I think we get, I think we run. I think we run. Huh, it didn't seem to do anything. There's more? Those things above their heads, so fascinating. I don't see any characters similar to like the karma symbols at a glance. It's hard to tell. I feel like the inner ring could maybe be... Oh, now it's passing through them. Interesting. So weird. Oh, I'm seeing like the X on these statues. I wonder, is this... Is this like a grave? Is this like when people ascend, they have a statue made of them in this... Now, now I'm getting more. Now I'm really feeling like I'm I'm trespassing in a sacred place. Uh, there goes nothing. I don't know how down is helping me, but this world, this planet, certainly is not 
normal. So I wouldn't be surprised if there's like something down here that loops me around to back to my family. Certainly fucking going up on the weirdness scale, that's for sure. Some curious Im imagery to round your night out with. Yeah, yeah, you can say that again, Jen. Hey, Poodly, welcome on by. I hope you are having a restful night. Um, I'm... Hello. Go to eat. Yeah, yeah, I have. <laughs> yeah, I know that feeling. I, I have a problem with that, too. God, this music. Re really, like, firing on all the ethereal sort of cylinders now. Oh, favorite night. Thank you for the follow. I hope you enjoy... Appreciate your ambiance, your sleep divide mine greatly. Aww, I hope, I hope you're able to get some good sleep and feel better. <laughs> Solid. I'm, I'm not. Aw, thank you for the head pass again. <laughs> Damn it. Fourth note, Drecky, you need to debug the, uh, the rare boot to not double play jazz. I'm not gonna lie, sometimes, on some people, uh, or half the time, uh, if I notice I haven't followed someone that I mean to be following, I'll wait for them to be, like, offline a few hours before I try and sneak in and follow. <laughs> Just pray they don't notice. <laughs> I don't want to be called out. <laughs> I I do not know where this ending is going because this is so trippy. We're seeing these weird things on screen. I they're like. I think they're like the things we've seen whenever we touch the 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 golden things, but I don't I don't know what they mean. I will say if this is like suddenly bad end, I even if it fits within the brutality of like, hey, this is a living ecosystem, like Darwinism something something something. Uh, even if it fits within Rain World Hardness, like, I don't, I wouldn't be satisfied with something like that. I'd be pretty disappointed, but I'm not gonna call it till it is it. Seems like the golden stuff is getting more solid. So if the golden stuff started showing up when we got the, the brain, the, the new the, the become more enlightened I wonder if it's supposed to represent how close we are to tra to to enlightenment to to a kind of transcendence but I don't know how that relates to me for me getting to my family unless this is me like hey this is where all the transcendental beings like went to. You can go down here and they can help you. Oh, that's kind of fucky. Thank you, Puds, and I hope you have a fantastic eat and a great weekend. Okay. I feel like reality is starting to crumble. Damn, it's even slowing down, like, 
opening my map. Everything is huh, sluggish. <laughs> um, I didn't bring a spear. I, do we do we drown? Is is that the place? Is, is there anything down here? these air bubbles or something I'm not losing oxygen okay so uh, this maybe is something different than water certainly some noise going on. Now we go to the mirror dimension, and we have to go all the way back in an inverted world. Back to Pebbles 5. This certainly is not giving me good end vibes, that's for sure. Um, well, we didn't stick to it, so it can't be too bad. Um, what? What the fuck's going on? Oh, God. Um, so I'm, I'm afraid your planet's infested by squids. Uh, we gotta, we got we, we gotta destroy it. I'm sorry. Uh, planet's haunted. Oh, hold. it. Well, they're on the same existence as me because it seems like I bumped into one. Like I, I'm kind of getting buffeted around. It seems. My controller's rumbling a bit. You know, just casually swimming amongst eldritch, unknowable entities. As one does, as a slug cat, um, I'm very concerned. This certainly is a way to convey how small you are in a cosmic scale, um, so I'll, I'll, I'll give it props to that. We are merely a speck of a creature upon a vast world. And some aspects of the world we are incapable of perceiving or understanding. Like ants on an elephant. Worm zone? Oh, sh shit, you right. This is my zone. This is my people. Friends! Comrades, Wems, good to see you. It has been a while since we've had a reunion, ah. It's been a crazy couple of years. How have you been, Steve? Still slithering in the black void of nothingness? Ha 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 ha. Jane, is that, is that some fresh uh, 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 stardust on your mane, I see? Very dashing. They're all just kind of, kind of swimming around. And you know what? Good for them. I'm too small. I'm too small for them to eat. And so you know what? There are advantages to being very, very tiny. Nothing can see you. I just want to get back to my family. Man, I am gonna have a story to tell. What? <laughs> Woo! Uh, 
All right. All right. What you, what you got for me next game? You gave me you gave me weird weird goopy stuff. You gave me uh I don't know. Evangelion breathing liquid. Actually, I think there's a real like liquid you can breathe in that will still keep you oxygenated. See now the now the weird entities just kind of look like uh, fireflies or or uh, like little candle lanterns floating in the wind. Now they're not so scary. <laughs> uh oh fuck oh fuck oh fuck it noticed me oh shit oh fuck oh fuck oh fuck oh fuck oh fuck oh fuck. Oh, I shouldn't have stabbed- I shouldn't have stabbed the garbage things. Oh, I didn't know. I'm sorry. I didn't know. I didn't know. I didn't know. Please! 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 I just want to get back to my family! I want to get back to my family! I'm just a little slick cat! Leave me alone! Please! Please! Alright, now it's just getting a little rude. Alright, you've been staring at me for a while- Oh! Oh fuck! Oh no 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 no! I'm not good bait. I'm not good bait. I don't I don't get good fit. Oh sh oh. Uh, I'm not in control anymore. Um. Oh, is it like fucking throwing me out? No no, it's pulling me down now. All right, we're uh we're being spaghettified. Taking Slugcat on some walkies. Woo wee! Slugcat is getting some exercise. I tell you what. Slug on a string. <laughs> Damn. Damn, I wish Puddles was still around. <laughs> you know, I, I've heard of rapid transit, but I gotta say, um,. Getting an extra dimensional worm to uh, hook you like fish, like like a worm on on a hook, is something else. I, uh. Oh, okay. We're now black and white. All right, I, gu I guess we got. I guess we we're not done with things being surreal as fuck. I guess I guess we're swimming all the way to the core. Instead of getting to our family, are we like just learning what the entire world is about? Um. Okay. Oh shit. Oh shit. Wait, am I transcending? Am I becoming a fourth dimensional entity? Able to perceive time layered upon itself? Existing simultaneously in multiple places at the same point? Or am I simply manifesting my duplication powers? Get my shadow clone no jutsu. Well, one of me seems to be faster than the others. Fuck that guy. You gotta slow down, bruv. You gotta get. You gotta. You gotta keep pace with all of us. You need me to. You need to be in synchron. Synchrony. Oh, I can't say the word. Uh, it's like in sync, but like a fancy word. And he's gone. Oh look, there's another one. We're certainly in a big old blackness, duplicating. Oh, oh, now they're fading away. Yes, thank you, Eldis Arcanium. Also, welcome on by. Oh, thanks for making room with the city, right?
Hmm. Okay, so... <sighs> you had a good bit of mysticism being built up, but this is kind of overstaying its welcome. Kind of like I... I feel like I get the point you're trying to get across. I feel like if you're going to do something like this, you have the eerie music and you have credits roll. Unless it's going to be like, there are no credits. Alright, if the game... If the game end is just this, and then I have to quit out, tell tell me now. I don't I don't want to I don't want to sit here. For, I know I had a I let myself get tased for about ten minutes before quitting out when we had that one bug. I don't want to sit here for another. Okay, you going? Okay. <laughs> I I would have felt really dumb if I just sitting here for like 10, 10, 20 minutes, just kind of going into the void, and it's like no no, no th this is the end. <laughs> Ah, uh, oh, you came over from that. Uh, okay. uh, you'd actually have to kind of specify because uh, Ray has done two things for me. He's done um, the PNG version of me um, that I had in case um, the thing I use. I mean, I I have like the very I have a used barely minimum phone capable of doing video tracking, face tracking, and whatnot. So I, I, I wasn't holding my breath how effective it was going to be. And then they also recently did a, uh, a, little bit, a little bit more of a character scene piece. Because uh, I wanted something... I know I go for a little more comfy, but the jungle's a brutal place. And uh, Ray's, Ray's gray style of, grayscale style of painting, I feel, is fantastic for for getting shadows and those darker colors, like, God, I fucking love it so much. Also, I don't know how your name is getting that nice navy blue, that dark blue kind of uh, border, but damn, that looks nice. I like that color. One of these days, I'll go back and tweak the, the chat widget there's a few things I would like to incorporate into it, but it's like, it's so minor. Like, it's pretty functional now. It has a lot of the major features I want, like the, the pronouns and the general shape. Uh, I'll probably remove that little border thing I have on it just because, like, it's nice, but to have any noticeable border, I kind of have to have a lot of area eaten up by it. A little, I don't know. Seems like a lot of effort for not too much gain. I don't know. Maybe I just need to refactor and be like less, be a little bit more minimalistic on the borders. Maybe set a different set of boundaries. Make it like because I think I think the borders I made them they're like ten pixels wide. So that's like a total of about a 20 pixels all around added to each message box. I'm wondering, maybe maybe it's something more minimalistic. I could save space and still look kind of kind of fun, kind of fancy. I did spend all that time figuring out how the fuck you do borders with CSS, so a little bit of sunk cost there. <laughs> I wonder if all these slug cats are all the times I died. Like if I counted every slug cat that's been duplicated on screen, if it would add up to all the deaths I've had. And if perhaps that's why it's taking so long to end the game. Is it has to has to put a slug hat on screen for every fucking death I had. <laughs> I 
So if I were to do the borders, so the borders are actually like a um, square image. And like the way CSS has it, it's basically sliced up. So it's defining the corners as 20 by 20. And then it will stretch or not stretch. It will tile the top and side pattern um, out for however long the message box is. So long or wide. Um, if I were to do any change to make things like to, to have thin sides but thick tops, um, I think I would have to do a little bit more digging into how CSS slices things up um, to be able to have that kind of granularity. It is, it is a little bit weird. I'm pretty sure it is possible. I would just have to do apply the brain, the old, the old serpent brain cell to it. The music hasn't really changed. It certainly feels like, uh, Certainly, would the music would not feel out of place in uh, Soma on any of the uh, water walking portions. That kind of whoopy, um underwater kind of warbliness. If you, if you go all the way to the core of the planet, you loop around to swimming in space, you know? It's just, that's just how it works. I will say, as soon as this game is done, I am going to go pretty fucking hard into the wiki. Because I want, I want to know. I want to know, I want to know what I'm right about, what I'm wrong about, what the fuck I missed. Um, I, I don't know, I don't know how different the other characters' gameplay is, if it's still overall the same thing, they have, like, the same ending, or if it's just stylistic kind of differences, I don't, I don't know if I'll stream the others. I don't know if it would be if it would be worthwhile. Um, probably one thing I'll try and scope out with the wiki, because I do think I had a, I had a lot of fun with this game. For for the little complaints I have, I feel like my, my I feel like my little complaints will will be fixed with just reading how things actually work in the game and a little bit of focused, like, actual practice. Because, uh, like, even though even though it was pointed out to me by someone of uh, one of the advanced movement techniques, um, I never would have thought of how to do it that way, even if I had accidentally done it a couple times, not realizing it. I, uh... would not... I, I would... I haven't done like any like movement practice to, to get better. So you get the raw amateur scrungly serpent playthrough. Jesus, this is so long. I mean I was joking about every duplicated slug being one of my deaths, but is it is it actually one of my deaths, or is this like this is how long the ending is, period. I mean, the game wanted me... Hold on, can I open my map? No, I can't open my map. Would I like a hint? Jesus fuck, is... 
Is there a fucking puzzle at the end of this? You gotta be kidding me. I mean, everything indicates I just need to go down. If I need to go back up, tell me now, because that makes no sense. Or if I need to actually, like, try and touch my... I need to, like, just touch my other selves. Is that what I need to do? Can I grab you? Can I throw you? Can I touch you? There's a light above you. Is there? I don't... Is there a light above me? I'm gonna be honest, I don't see any difference. Okay, now I'm starting to see a difference. Yeah, yeah, I'm starting to see a difference now, and I see I see shadows, okay. Yeah, look, I... I have stigmatism, right? I don't have perfect eyes. And that's what I'm gonna, that's what I'm gonna blame. Alright, now this is very obvious. Okay. I don't know why you want me to go down, and now you want me to go up, game. Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna put that, we're gonna put that as my fifth minor complaint. You don't do environmental storytelling and then have contrary directions like this. Kasara, I was, I was refraining from saying that the whole fucking time! I'm just like... God, these slug cats, man, they got, uh, mm, they are a certain shape. Uh, <laughs> I'm glad I'm not the only one who's been thinking about that. <laughs> huh. So, are we... are we bringing a bunch of slug cats? Or is this... us? Oh my god, the slug cat close up! Oh my god, it's so cute! Oh my god! Uh... Is that a tree of slug cats? Is that the slug cat afterlife just living in a tree? Fair enough, fair enough. Now it's credits. Oh, ascension. Alright, well I guess that confirms that. You have left the world behind. Okay. Okay, first off, pebbles. Motherfucker, I'm trying to get back to my family, and you put me on the path of enlightenment? I mean... Okay, but also... Kind of a dick move? Like, that's not what I wanted? Damn. That's kind of fucked up, because now my family thinks I'm dead. But it also, like, there looked like to be a, lunch, a bunch of other slug cats. So it seems like my slug cat is not the first one to have ascended. Like, we don't really know, or I didn't really learn a lot about slug cat, like, culture and life. Like, maybe back in wherever the family is, they're as advanced as the scavengers. Because they do use spears, they can, you know, they have took care of their young, you know, they could be, they could have a burgeoning civilization themselves. 
yeah, we can't speak to fucking pre-civilization, pre, uh, 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 previous civilization remnant entities who have been built up bodies of knowledge far beyond the primitive slug cats. Um, I do think it is really interesting because usually when you think of ascending or like when you think of enlightenment, not just like spiritually in like a religious term, but in a like technological singularity way, because, you know, we had all these machines, we had towers rising above the clouds, we had this technology like imposing zero gravity at its own will, we had all these electronics. You think of going to space, you think of exploring the galaxy, um, but the game actually sends you down. It sends you into the past, into history, and you reach enlightenment back that way. I do think that is very... I find that kind of interesting, because it's kind of like... Enlightenment is not simply rising above where you came from and escaping it. It's more about with what you have, um, embracing it, making the best of it, and returning to it. Um, Sort of like, I, I would interpret it more as, I, I, I think some might say is like Gaia theory. Um, is like there is, there is a spirit of the planet that our souls return to and are born from. Um, I think that's kind of interesting. It's certainly not what I expected. And, and I, I imagine I'm going to go all over between the fact that we have we had the technological top world. We went through like caves and subterranean areas, and then we broke into another technological area. And then we got back to another cave spiritual area. Really, really, really a lot of cycles in this game, it seems like. There's a lot of implied history. Very good game. Very happy. Very happy I played this. And I hope y'all had a great time at my expense sometimes. <laughs> I would say the <clears throat> the endings was a little bit more drawn out. Does does anyone know off the top of their head if the like the peoples who made this game were any kind of specific like denomination or from certain places because like i i say that simply because you know i was calling out a lot of like cultivation eastern fantasy things and I i'm certainly not a lot used to like karma and and reincarnation things i'm not too familiar with those um but i do think of like a lot of eastern european games sometimes have a lot of very similar themes so I'm just sort of wondering if this is a game from a more um, Southeast Asian sort of area or if they have certain backgrounds that kind of put these themes in the game or if they just sort of did research on and put them in this game. I've heard this game is inspired by Buddhism. Are there any specific, uh, certainly something I'm probably going to like rapidly dig into and search oh the dev is Swedish oh that is certainly he did said he was inspired by his time in Seoul fascinating I didn't have I I was actually in South Korea's for a little while I did not have I didn't have any of the free time I didn't really have as much free time as I wished to do much exploration. Um, I kind of wish I had the time, because I know there is a lot of really good culture there. 
there's a lot of really cool places. I mean, there's there's a lot of good culture and fascinating places anywhere, which is which is why I, I would say one of the best things you can invest in. Uh, like I. I, I'll probably repeat it forever. I, my philosophy is you should you should try and get as much experiences as you can and broaden your experiences. But if you if you are able to travel someplace um, someplace else in the world and just try see see the cultures that that came up there, 